Hi guys, welcome to BPREP where we whiteboard quant questions appeared in previous year papers. Before we start with the question, please take a moment to subscribe to the channel to get updates on latest videos if you are preparing for any of the competitive exams. Let's start. A 1 rupee coin is placed on a table. The maximum number of similar 1 rupee coins which can be placed on the table around it with each of them touching it and only two others. Okay, so uh, we have a 1 rupee coin, let's say this is the coin and uh, now we are trying to place similar coins around this coin, okay. So let's say this is the other coin and this is the other coin, this is one more, so that every coin is touching two adjacent coins and the center one, okay. And uh, this way we are placing all the coins. So let's say there are n coins and we don't know how many coins can be placed here in this way. Okay, so we need to find out this number, how many coins can be placed. Okay, so uh, let's say uh, the radius of the coin is r. Okay, so now uh, if we join the centers of these coins in this way, so this is R, this is R, this is R, this is R and this is R, okay, and this is also R. So the triangle which is formed with sides 2 R H is an equilateral triangle, okay. So if this is an equilateral triangle, all angles will be of 60 degree, okay. So this angle will also be of 60 degree, okay. So these two coins, these two coins are making an angle of 60 degree at the center okay now uh, if we add one more coin so let's add one more coin here and again if we join the center of this coin and this center of the other coin uh, in a similar way this angle will again be 60 degree okay so here also uh, it's making 60 degree okay same way uh, if this coin, if we consider this coin and we join the centers, then it will make an angle of 60 degree. So every coin we add will make an angle of 60 degree at the center. Okay. So, and uh, what, what is the uh, total value at the center? Total degree is possible at the center. It is 360 degree, right? So total we have 360 degree and uh, every coin is making 60 degree at the center. So if we divide 60 degree by, sorry, 360 by 60, this is 6, okay. So there can be total 6 coins placed in this fashion so that they are touching each other and the center also. So 6 is the correct answer. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any doubts or questions, please post in comments. And guys, please do subscribe to the channel by clicking the subscribe button below to get updates on latest videos. Thank you.